Sledgehammer's been around for hundreds of years, a lump of steel on the end of a pole. This is the first time somebody sat down and actually thought about a redesign that's going to make things better for, for the guys out there using them. There are two lengths of handle for the Gorilla Sledgehammers, 345 millimetres or 13 and 5 eighths inches for the two mini hammers, and 780 millimetres or 30 and 3 quarter inches for the larger ones. Also take a look at the holes at the end of the handles. These are absolutely ideal for hanging the, the sledgehammers up in the garage or the workshop, and also for putting a lanyard through to hang up when you're working at height. Gorilla Sledgehammers from Roughneck. The shape makes the difference. What do I mean? Um, these are absolutely unique. Really strong construction. For example, the head, uh, there's some sort of jiggery pokery that they've done there, but that head will never come away from that handle. That's really all you need to know. Look at the shape. Really hardened steel at both ends and a ball at the end of one of the, the, the hammer sections. The force is absolutely concentrated into one small spot. You'll see later when it's being used, that really makes a difference. All of that impact on one tiny spot, rather than spread out over a big face. The ball is ideal for slabs, the face ideal for walls. On the sides, these aren't hardened. That means that it's going to be dead easy to use that for banging down fence posts and stuff. So Gorilla sledgehammers in six sizes from three to 12 pounds really do make a difference and it's the shape that does it.